Hello, hello, handbag lovers. Welcome back to my channel. Welcome to a new video. If you're new here, my name is Kayla, and today I am so happy because I want to share with you my new Louis Vuitton handbag. And yes, it's in the new Damielicious collection 2024. So let's get started. Okay, so every year for my birthday, I like to get a new luxury handbag. And my birthday is June 1st, and I always get my birthday back on May because I'm that kind of person I can wait. This year, I was eyeing some handbags, and of course, I have in my wish list some handbags but I wasn't like 100% in love of none of them. I mean, I like them, but I wasn't that sure. And because I am in a low buy year regarding handbags, this time I am taking my time deciding what handbag I want to get because also I decide that I don't want to sell uh, any of my luxury handbags that I have now because at the end of the day, I always ended up losing money. So that's why I took my time this time and I'm going to leave you with the unboxing and if you know me, if you follow me for a while, you know that my favorite style in Louis Vuitton is the Speedy 20 or the Alma BB. So this is a Speedy 20 or an Alma BB. So let me know in the comments which one do you think it is and I will leave you with the unboxing and I will come back. So yes, I got another Ama BB in this new Damielicious canvas and I love it. And it's so funny because this handbag, it was not in my wish list. It was not a handbag that I was eyeing. And if you are new here, I already have the trifecta on the Ama BB. I love the Ama BB style. I said already that I wish I had this bag in like every color because I love this style. But the one that it was in my wish list, it was the Speedy 20 and the color is really, really beautiful too. But for some reason, like I said, I wasn't 100% sure. And then I saw this one in person and it was love at first sight. When I saw it, I was like, oh my God, it's so cute. It's so fun. The colors are really, really cute. And I realized that this handbag is a handbag that is going to go with a lot of my outfits, even though it's kind of like very colorful. Colorful. It's kind of like uh, something different in my collection. I mean, I have four Alma BBs, but um, what I mean is the color on the canvas. And this is it. Uh, it is really beautiful. I'm going to do close up here. We have uh, the Louis Vuitton uh, Paris logo here, and the colors are really, really beautiful i love them and for some reason i thought the colors they were going to be more vibrant but no i really really like uh, the colors actually and i love it because i wear a lot of pink outfits i have a lot of pink dresses and we have uh the keda on the handles i'm kind of like a little bit worried about that but I will treat the Vaqueta with the Apple Guard. It, it always works great for me. And we have here um, the bottom. And of course, the Alma BB comes with fit, with, which is amazing. I have this tag here. I don't know if I'm going to leave it with the tag or just uh, like this for some reason. For example, my monogram, I just love to wear it like this with anything. And in the Damien Azur, I have the lock and also the tag. And in the Damien event, I always like to put like some charms and things like that. But this one, I think will look better with anything because it's already very colorful. Um, I don't know yet. I'm not sure. I'm going to see. This one is made in France. It says right there, which is really, really great. It is funny because I realized until now that it was made in France, like 
I know a lot of people care about that. Got this handbag Friday, today is Wednesday, and uh, of course when I got it, I like to inspect the handbag um, to make sure that everything is great, that it's in perfect condition, that you know, like it's nothing wrong with the handbag. You know, it's funny, the only issue that I've had in a handbag with Louis Vuitton is with my pochette Matisse is West. Uh, the first one that I got was made in USA and the one grommet in the strap broke. I think the second time that I was wearing the handbag, I think I was doing the matcha for the video and uh, the strap broke. But they got me a new one and the new one was made in France. But I think I have the Speedy uh, in the canvas was made in USA and I haven't had any problem with that handbag. But yeah, this one was made in France, which which I am happy. Okay, now I'm going to do the zipper check. First one, really smooth. The second one is really smooth too. I mean, at the beginning, they are a little bit sturdy in this style in the Alma BB, but you know, when you use the bag, they get really, really smooth, and I love that. And the zipper was the first thing that I checked. And the zipper was the first thing that I checked in this handbag because uh, Melissa from her channel, Melissa Adams Way, she got the Speedy 20 in this uh, new Damielicious canvas and her zipper was really, really sturdy. So I was uh, curious to see how the zipper was in this handbag and it's really really nice okay now i'm going to show you the interior i have here uh the lock i don't know if i'm going to sometimes i like to put the lock uh you know to uh like for decoration purposes but i'm i don't know if i'm going to do it on this handbag and i have this wrap here which i'm going to get in a minute but look how gorgeous is this interior it's really really pretty of course i'm going to get an organizer for this handbag because this interior is really really light and then we have a small pocket here and the canvas in this pocket is um, the squares are smaller than uh, this canvas and is this canvas is really cute actually okay now this strap Finally, finally, uh, the Ama BB has an adjustable strap. And I think this is a reason why many people don't buy this handbag because of the strap, um, because it wasn't not adjustable. Now it is. Finally, leave it on her, the customers. And in the other Ama BBs that I have, I hated the strap because uh, crossbody, it was a little bit long on me. And also, of course, long shoulder, it was really, really long. I am 5'2". And most of the time, I wear uh, my Alma BB just uh, top handle or on the crook of my arm. And if I want, and if I'm going to walk all day with the handbag, I like to wear a strap that is a little bit more wide than this strap. But I love this strap in my Neverfull BB. I wish my Neverfull BB came with this strap. Actually, it is really, really great. I'm going to show you how it looks in the shortest length. I am 5'2", and in the shortest length, uh, it is perfect for me. Actually, if I'm going to wear the handbag just long shoulder. Crossbody is a little bit short, and in the longest, of course, it's going to be long on me because like I said, I'm 5'2". I like to wear this strap for me, it's perfect here in the four or uh, in the four uh, hole. Yeah, I'm really, really happy that now the strap is adjustable. So this is a strap that I'm going to use for sure in other handbags. And you know what I realized? I think I'm missing the two tags that the Leviton bags come with. They always come with, like with two like small tags. Uh, one that is like the barcode, and the other one it has the name and the um, and the number and the number of the bag. Let me see if it's in the box because I like to have those tags if I want to sell the bags. I don't think I will sell this one, but just in case it's not in the box. Let me see in the receipts. Only have three things here. Well, 
it's not there i don't know if they don't come with those tags anymore or what but yeah this is my new baby my new handbag like i said since i already have the trifecta i was ready to try another style and i love it because it's really fun and um the other one is going to be for sure a neppy leather one and i'm going to stop there five is more than enough and uh, but yeah i love it it's really cute uh the only thing i'm worried is about the the kid of leather i don't know how i'm going to like it when um you know patina uh well we'll see about that but yeah i'm really happy uh with her right now it's really really perfect for this summer so you, this is the video for today i hope you like it please don't forget to give me thumbs ups also subscribe to my channel if you like this kind of content and see you until my next video bye